Ladies and gentlemen, Team Nameless here again with more Mega Man X. This time we're taking down not armored armadillo. Yeah. Huh. Interesting how they got these ideas. Yes. Let's do it. Ooh, riding on cars! Weeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeeee
But besides those caught in the Yeah. Really? You're using fire underwater? Oh please, Mario does it all the time. <laughs> Stupid. They made a big point out of that in lost levels. Oh look, you have to dodge fire bars underwater. <laughs> Cause fuck Lost logic. Levels is on sale in the eShop. Don't buy it. I'm, I'm not going to. But Speaking of which, I found my copy of Mario Deluxe recently. What mm. does that include? If you get over 300,000 points and uh, part of that's a remake of Mario 1, you get to... Yes, something. You get to play the first eight worlds of Lost Levels. Except it's oh. better, because it's in Deluxe, and they made changes that don't make it nearly as cheap, in my opinion. Ha. <laughs> and yeah. we're almost dead. Just kidding, we got a life. Mm -hmm. I know I have to wait for this thing to push me up. Here it is. Let's go. Wee. Oh, yeah. Jet health. Dude, this music is catchy. Yeah, this game has a fantastic soundtrack. We One of the best in the series. Better than Mega Man 2's, in my opinion. Ooh, James, that's a... that's... Uh, be careful. I mean, Mega Man 2 has a catchy as hell soundtrack, but I honestly like this one better. Alright, that's your opinion. Oh no. You downed the ship. And now I'm sinking. And I look guys. It's a mini boss. And what really? Yeah. I know that oh. this one's optional. It's... I'm just going after him to get the heart tank. No, I'm gonna have to find another one of these things later. <laughs> this is uh that Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time boss. Volvagia, it's an underwater edition. Volvagia in the water temple? Volvagia is from the fire temple, stupid. No, I'm talking about if they put him in the water temple. Yeah, and they removed that creepy tentacle thing. Oh, I haven't played Ocarina of Time in forever. Yeah, that's a good game. Oh yeah, it's just that, honestly, I, I didn't even get the 3DS version. The last time I played it, literally, was when I was a little kid. In a and my next door neighbor had it on his N64. Or Ford N64, I should say. Huh. Ah, so good to know. Indeed. Yes. Back in those days, I didn't have to own a game system because he had both a PS1 and an N64. Why the hell would I have to own anything? That was like, oh my god. Why do I need to own a system? I can just go next door. <laughs> and, we're, yep. and we're like best friends too, so it's like fighting underwater Volvagia. La 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 la. Oh no, you cut off underwater Volvagia's face. Mm -hmm. And. We found, yeah, I think, yeah, this uh, a light capsule in Mega Man Extreme, I think. Cool. As you can tell, I probably played too many Mega Man games to be considered healthy. Ha. Yeah. Even the obviously obscure ones. Even really? though Mega Man Extreme, I actually played because my cousin had that. And he was cool and let me borrow his Game Boy sometime. Hmm. See, if only we, if only I could play Mega Man powered up. They're so cute. Mm -hmm. But you don't have a PSP, but I do. It's so great. I, it, it's basically, when configured right, a, a freaking PS1 emulator. So you can play like Final Fantasy VII and stuff. Yeah, but it takes up ridiculous amounts of space. Darn. Well, I mean, what do you expect? Uh, the game, if I remember correctly, was on multiple discs when it came out. Yeah. How even newer Final Fantasies are like that. Final Fantasy XIII, that thing takes up several discs. That's yeah. on the 360. Lol. <laughs> so 
Come on, you can beat underwater bullfrog. Yeah. I know I can. I know I can beat the giant snake thing. I've done it before too. Good. Is it, wait, isn't this the second time you're fighting it? Yeah, I thought I fought him before to get the heart tank. This is the only heart tank mandatory right time I thought, uh, fought him. The first time was All right. Oh, I just okay. did it because I'm 100 percenting this. Yep. Like a boss. Yep. Watch out. Oh no! Yeah, that fish doesn't hurt you. If he catches you, he just kind of swallows you. He just like numb. It's like an enemy that exists less to be a threat and more to be a mild annoyance. Okay, so it's launch, launch octopus. octopus. Who in the PSP remake of this game has a British accent? Pens. What? Actually, oh my god. Oh, he's not that hard. Another thing I should mention, especially when you have weaknesses, like actually in most Mega Man games, the bosses are pretty easy. Yeah. Like in Mega Man 2, everybody is weak to Metal Man. Yes. That's why you always go after Metal Man first. I, that's what I told you. And... Yep. Young and then one. I took down Woodman. Then I took down Air Man, which wasn't as hard as I thought it would be. You can defeat Air Man, he's easy. Yeah, you just gotta use the leaf shield on him. I actually found the easiest. I did. Someone actually did manage to make Air Man difficult. How? They made a hack of the original Super Mario Brothers, where it called versus Air Man. Oh God, no! Have you ever Air tried fighting? Oh, look, a diamond. Oh the God! Easiest in the game. Yeah, just imagine it. And Mario is so floaty too. Going through Air Man stage. I, I, I'm not. Sure, floaties to worry, but some enemies take multiple jumps to kill on that game, right? Right. But you bounce off slightly to the right, and Mario oh, isn't exactly the most responsive. Yeah, that's true, so you end up like jumping off the cliffs. Yeah, so a lot of times, you know, you'll just be randomly falling, even though, you know, you could have sworn. And you were holding there was a platform, like, right yeah. to the right. It's kind of like the same thing that happened in some of the fortress levels and boss levels. Yeah. Why don't you Don't. use one of your abilities? Because I'm out of rolling shield now. Oh. Darn. You can do it! You can do it! Spoiler alert. I think he actually does it this time. No, it's the one time I actually don't take him on with any abilities. It's the one time I defeat him. I mean, nice. the, the time I defeat him, not the one time. I've been this guy a hell of a lot in the past. There we go. Boom, bam, bibbity, blop. No more launch octopusy. You could say, dead. you could say that uh, that launch octopus was tonight's main dish. Sushi. Mm. Actually, have you ever had... Uh, octopus? Not, yeah, octopus before. Yeah, it's really good. Yeah. I was going to say squid, and I was like, wait, so I can use an octopus, but... I've actually well, had both before, and it's pretty good, and... The part's over. Oh, cool.